Away from Parliament, inflation for the month of May 2024 dropped significantly to 23.1%, down from 25% in April 2024. This represents a 1.9 percentage point decrease between April and May 2024. According to the Ghana Statistical Service, food inflation contributed to the overall drop in the rate of inflation, recording a rate of 22.6% compared to 26.8% last month. However, non-food inflation increased slightly to 23.6% in May 2024, up from 23.5% in April 2024. Inflation for locally produced items and imported items fell to 24.7% and 19.6% respectively. Speaking to journalists in Accra, government statistician Professor Samuel Kobnenim urged policymakers to focus on transportation, which recorded a month-on-month -month increase of 10.5%. With them just last week, pointed to the fact that they have a better understanding of how tomato failed in the first quarter of 2023. So, this definitely, from the farm gate perspective, in terms of prices that they collect, is no news to them because they already have that information. And we have collected this information from the consumer perspective, and it's going to complement that. In this case, what I want the media and policymakers to engage to engage discussion on is not food inflation, but in this case, it's transport, where we are seeing a month-on-month -month transport inflation of 10.5%, when overall month-on-month -month is 3.2%. And we all do appreciate how transport permeates across the other items that we have in the basket for the computation. So a conversation that I really wish will be on the table going forward is how do we ensure that the consistent but slowly increases in prices of fuel at the, at the pumps would slow down and